With summer just approaching and Memorial Day right around the corner, many desire to get out on North Dakota's waters. But before you leave the dock, you need to know the water conditions. And right now, the Corps of Engineers reports that Lake Sakakawea's water elevations are still lower than last year. Kiara Brown is going to tell you how that could impact your lake plans this year. The sweet sounds of summer in North Dakota are just itching to be heard. And after the recent snow, rain, and chilly weather patterns, many from all around North Dakota are eager to get their boats out on the water. While some hoped the extra precipitation benefited lake elevations around the state, that is not the case for Lake Sakakawea. Overall, we're still looking at a below normal uh, runoff year for the entire basin. Mm -hmm. So we have implemented uh, conservation measures for the system. Lindquist says the recent weather has slightly helped the conditions, but about 80% of the basin is still abnormally dry, and some parts are still considered to be in drought conditions. 1829 uh, is our current elevation. We're about a foot higher than we had forecasted to be at this time. So uh, the, the recent rains have helped. Uh, it's not going to make a dramatic impact. It's going to take continued precipitation in a large area of the basin to, to support a significant recovery in reservoir elevations. So how will this impact your summer aquatic plans? Luckily, Lindquist says for avid boaters and fishermen, most won't notice much of a difference. But ahead of a busy Memorial Day weekend, he says boaters need to be cautious of swimming in hypothermic temperatures and says depth finders are necessary for steering clear of abnormally high sandbars and islands that will stick out more than usual. Despite the water levels, that hasn't stopped his team from gearing up for the busy holiday weekend coming up. Memorial Day typically kicks off our, our busy season. Um, we did open our campgrounds this past weekend. Most of our concessionaires have also opened their campgrounds, so I think we're we're going to be in really good shape to be ready for a, a busy Memorial Day weekend. Lindquist wants to remind the public about the importance of boater safety. He says the safety of the public is his top priority. For KX News in Riverdale, I'm Kiara Brown. Additionally, the North Dakota Game and Fish Department says fishing on Lake Sakakawea should be pristine this year with Goodyear classes of walleye all throughout the river and reservoir.